CBS 2 exclusive tonight. The NYPD Hate Crimes Task Force investigating after someone hurled concrete through a Jewish woman's apartment window. CBS 2's Ali Bauman speaking to the victim tonight about the disturbing rise in anti Semitic hate. Because this is a big, nice big picture window. A piece of plywood now covers Rochelle's front window. The last time this Bronx mother looked through the glass, she was preparing Shabbos on Friday. I noticed a young man crossing from the corner of my eye, holding something in the back. She showed us this surveillance footage, which she says shows the moment a man walked up and hurled something through her second story window. It was this heavy slab of concrete, which missed her by inches. I actually just froze for a split second and stood there because there were shards of glass on my sweatshirt. Rochelle believes the man targeted her window for the Israeli flag and pro-Israeli sticker she displays. She asked we not share her full name for her safety. Oh. This was a hate crime. The NYPD Hate Crimes Task Force is now investigating this. Data from the department shows while hate crimes overall are down citywide so far this year, last month anti-Semitic hate crimes not only spiked 50% compared to last year, but they also made up the majority of all reported hate crimes in the city. It doesn't just affect the victim, it affects the entire community because everybody wonders, am I next? Scott Richmond is regional director of the Anti-Defamation League, which recently released a report finding 2022 was the worst year for anti-Semitism in the U.S. in four decades. There's been a general rise in hate. Rochelle told me she's sharing her story as a warning, but not to instill fear. Be more of who you are and not be ashamed of who you are. And her Israeli flag is not going anywhere. In the Pelham Parkway section of the Bronx, Ali Bauman, CBS 2 News.